اوكي هنكمل مع بعض مشوارنا في يونت 6 الدرس ده اللي هو صفحه 88 بيج 88 قطعه ريدنج بعنوان بيكينج انتو اور ميديكال فيوتشر اوكي الاستغراق في مستقبلنا الطبي بيكينج Okay. Speaking يعني نظرة خاطفة نظرة خاطفة أو إلقاء نظرة على مستقبلنا الطبي أو ماشي medical future. تعالوا نسمع. Peaking into our medical future. Did you know that a drop of your blood can predict diseases you may develop in the future? يقول لك هل تعلم أن نقطة من دمائك ممكن تتنبأ بالأمراض اللي ممكن تصيبك في المستقبل؟ This is possible through genetic testing. Testing هذا ممكن حدوثه مع اختبارات الجينات الوراثية genetic testing that analyzes the genetic information found in the cells of your body. Each cell contains a sample of DNA. طبعا بتفحص ال DNA اللي موجود في الخلايا داخل جسمك. The information in DNA can help determine a person's risk of developing certain diseases. طبعا المعلومات الموجودة على DNA ممكن تساعدنا في التنبؤ بالأمراض اللي ممكن تصيب الشخص ده. Years from now. The most common type of genetic testing is called newborn screening. أحدث صيحة موضوع genetic testing اسمها newborn screening. Newborn مواليد جديدة. Screening زي شاشة أو فحص. The goal of newborn screening is to identify treatable genetic disorders in newborn babies. طبعا الهدف من البرنامج ده التعرف على الأمراض التي قد تصيب النيوبورن لأطفال حديث الولادة. In many countries, infants are screened in the hospitals shortly after they are born. Although it is rare to find that a baby has a genetic disorder, Those that do have a disorder start receiving treatment right away. This early diagnosis and treatment prevents physical and mental problems, and sometimes even death. Another type of genetic testing is called predictive gene testing. This is used to predict an adult's risk of developing certain diseases later in life. People who undergo this type of genetic testing are usually from a family in which many members have had a particular inherited disease, like certain cancers or Alzheimer's disease. There are many obvious benefits to this kind of testing. A negative test, a test that says a person is not likely to develop a disorder, can bring a tremendous sense of relief. Jen Thompson, who recently underwent predictive gene testing for colon cancer, explains, So many people in my family died of colon cancer. I worried constantly. When the test came back negative, I felt as if someone had lifted an enormous weight off my shoulders. A positive test has benefits as well. It warns of the need for preventative care, like frequent checkups, dietary changes, medicines, or even the option of surgically removing the part likely to develop the disease. For example, if Thompson's test had been positive, she might have chosen to have her colon removed. There are also some controversial downsides to genetic testing. The value of genetic testing is particularly questionable when testing for a disease that is untreatable. For example, Alzheimer's disease runs in An Lee's family. An has decided to get genetic testing to see if she is likely to develop it. But her husband Bao is not happy about her choice. Bao explains, if the result is positive, How will it help to know that she will probably develop the disease? If I had the Alzheimer's gene, I wouldn't want to know. Another issue is that even if someone tests positively for a disease, it doesn't mean that they will definitely develop the disease. 
so a person could spend years worrying about something that never ends up happening. Genetic testing has the potential to impact millions of lives in the future. Many are excited about the future of genetics, while others have deep concerns about it. But for better or for worse, soon we may all have the ability to peek into our medical future. طبعا هيمكن الناس كلها من هم يتوغلوا في السجل المرضي حقهم ويقدر يتنبؤوا بالامراض اللي ممكن لا سمح الله تصيبه يعني. اوكي. نشوف الترو اند فولس صح والخطا. To get a sample of DNA, doctors must draw a large quantity of blood. هل الكلام ده صحيح؟ عشان اعمل لك عينه من الدي ان اي لازم اخد كميه كبيره جدا من الدم. هو اللي فولس يا What do you think? False. طبعا false ما يحتاج. Newborn screening is not a common type of genetic testing. هل هو not a common type ولا common type؟ هو قالها في القطعة. نشوف الإجابة الأولى للأخ اللي جاوبها ونقول false is not a صح؟ طيب نشوف هنشوف إجابتك ها غلط يا بطل لا هو قال لك هو قالها قالها إن هي إن هي فعلا common type of genetic فهي تعتبر predictive gene الجين اللي هو بيتم بيتم التنبؤ به تيستنج في الاختبار كان بي دان فور تريتابل اند ان تريتابل ديسوردرز ترتيبات اللي بيتم علاجها او التي لا يتم علاجها الكلام ده ايش؟ نشوف اجابات الناس على الشات طيب نشوف البطل قال لي صح ترو ممتاز يا بطل صح ترو تمام Okay. Positive test generally brings great relief to the test taker. Huh? طيب. العمودي قال صح. True. Sorry, يا بطل. ما هي true. هو عايز يقول لك إيش؟ إن الاختبار الإيجابي اللي بتطلع نتيجة موجبة عادة بيبقى معناها great relief. Relief. راحة أو تخلص من التست تيكر اللي هو اللي بياخد الاختبار طبعا لا فولس. If someone tests positively for disease لو واحد عمل الاختبار حقه طلع إيجابي للمرض they will definitely develop the disease. ناس قالت صح لا طبعا ما هي صح. الإجابة فولس. Okay. Speaking now, okay. I don't think so. But after that, we'll see. We'll see if there's any time left. Page 90. How do you think people decide on a field of study or job? If I think that the people can decide on a field of study or job, which factors, 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 I chose to try out a number of things before settling on one field of study or profession. I had originally wanted to go to art school, 
but it changed my mind when I found out how hard it was for graduates to find employment. I was also reluctant to go ahead with it, because I knew that my father was likely to disapprove in a quiet but very noticeable manner. He wanted me to study medicine, but I didn't. I took a number of courses in typing, shorthand, French, art, design, and literature, and worked part-time as a public relations assistant, a shop assistant, etc. Eventually, I started studying psychology, philosophy, and linguistics. I had also managed to attend a teaching methodology course that qualified me as a language teacher, but I was not at all certain that I wanted a teaching career. At some point, I was approached by a new airline company that invited me to do an interview, followed by a test before I could be offered a job. At the time, I used to help out with registration at a large language center where my uncle taught. So, I agreed to spend the next few days working for them from morning till evening, totally forgetting the airline company. Two days later, the man I knew from the airline company turned up and accused me of being irresponsible because I had not bothered to check with the airline company on the final results and a job offer. He said there was still time to do it, but I would have to drop what I was doing and run. For some reason, I did exactly the opposite. I stayed put thanked him, and went back to work. Later that evening, I was offered my first teaching job by the director of studies. I have often wondered what my life would have been like if I had chosen the airline company instead, but not too enthusiastically. Regardless of difficulties and ups and downs, this is the choice that has become a life's choice, and no amount of wondering is likely to ever make me regret it. Okay, guys. Bad Masmana. We'll have to test if what did the writer originally want to study. Can we see what he does for assess? Why did he give up? Well, it's a clear I was testing my original plan. Why do you think he took different training courses? The mother got up in the whole ahead. Training course with some clinic show. Okay. What had he done to qualify? إيش اللي سواه عشان يعمل qualify يحسن من الجودة? As a language teacher, يا مدرس لغة إنجليزية. What other job opportunity did he have? إيش الوظائف الفرص الوظائف الأخرى? Opportunity يعني فرصة عمل. What prompted him? إيش اللي دفعه? To make his final choice, you know, his final decision. What would you have done? Here, I will like. How do you think people decide on a field of study? كيف تعتقد الناس بتقرر مجال دراستها أو الجاب أو الوظيفة أو العمل? Which factors, which factors affect or do affect on their decision or choice, قرارهم أو اختيارهم? Read the text. Again and find out as a figure of any other question. At the soil level, are all the events, how could the events presented in chronological chronological order? Tertib mantiq yani tertib al hol chronological. Mr. Suri, how do you know? Tawal ijaba hai. Not all events are presented in chronological order. For example, I had originally wanted to go to art school. Indicates that he, this was so before the writer finished school. ما هو ترتيب فعلي يعني؟ ما هو ترتيب chronological؟ 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 ما هو ترتيب الزمني؟ okay. نسمعها كده. هذا بالأمريكي. Chronological. هذا البريتش تقريبا زيها. Chronological. Okay. هاي مشي. Which sentences, phrases, words provide information about the writer's thoughts, attitude, and feelings? 
هذه الإجابة Which part reveals the writer's position on the matter؟ أي جزء بيقول position ومكانه يعني The last paragraph reveals the writer's positions Are there section phrases؟ Okay. Put it on the same. So I have the same. No one have it by graph. No one my way will let me write in plus Muhammad at a year. You like think of an important decision. Fucker he got our Mohim Gidden or a family member has made. أنت أو واحد من أسرتك اتخذوا. Compare what you lie, what your life is like now. شوف أنت حياتك هتكون عاملة إزاي أو what it would have been like if you are you or a family member. أنت أو واحد من أسرتك had made different decision. Use the chart to recognize. هتقول الله حياتك الآن وكان ممكن حياتك تكون كيف. How life would have been differently. كانت مختلفة تماماً. زي كده واحد كاتبه A life changing position يقول لك After I graduated from high school بعد ما خلصت المدرسة الثانوية I had the choice of going to a university كان عندي الخيار إني أروح الجامعة In my hometown or Going to one far from home. ممكن أروح الجامعة اللي موجودة في بلدي أو أروح جامعة بعيدة جدا عن مكاني. اخترت إن أروح الجامعة اللي هي far from. It's short to go to the university. Far from home. على الرغم من although I'm happy with my choices, أنا سعيد بخياراتي. Sometimes I feel as I lived a million miles from home. أحيان أحيان أفكر إن أنا عايش على بعد ملايين الأميال من بيتي ومن من مكاني الأصلي يعني. If I had chosen differently, لو كان عندي الخيار اختلاف, it would have led to a very different life for me. كان يؤدي إلى حياة مختلفة تماماً بالنسبة لي. Okay. Second صفحة واحد وتسعين. اثنين وتسعين ثلاثة وتسعين أعتقد نخليها اللي حسب بكرة لأن ده جرامر أنتوا عارفين الجرامر لازم السبورة تتفتح وتاخد وقت أوكي تمام تمام يبقى بكرة إن شاء الله والحصة القادمة والفيديو القادم ده هنعمل آخر شرح في الوحدة السادسة اللي هو صفحة اثنين وتسعين وثلاثة وتسعين طيب